Damn it, Harvey, pick up the goddamn phone because this entire firm is a ghost town and I'm sorry Mike's in prison, but if we don't figure something out, what you and your little sidekick did is gonna be the end of us. And don't give me some bullshit about tonight isn't the time because... I gotta go. Yeah, I know, I'm coming with you. Rachel, you heard what Lewis said. It's gonna be a rough night, you need to stay here. Harvey, it's gonna be a rough night no matter where I am. And at least if I'm with you, there's a chance that I could be of some use. You better get your coat because we don't have much time. Now what? Now you get dressed. And you wait. Would you like some more drinks? Can I offer you an appetizer? Maybe some truffle fries? Or are we allowed to talk business now? All right, Lewis. What do you think we should do, since it was your recommendation that landed us in this mess in the first place? I recommended that because it was a last-ditch effort to get Mike out of prison. And you also said we'd only lose 50% of our partners to Evan Smith. How could I have known that she had the capacity to bring on more than that? Don't you get it? The rest didn't go to Evan Smith. They just walked the hell out and went somewhere else. Then we could sue their asses. With what lawyers, what resources, and what money? Because I don't know if you've noticed, but this firm has been gutted because of your recommendation. No, Jessica, it was gutted because of mine. Damn it, Lewis, I told you not to call him. Well, I did, because he's a partner, and like he just said, he was the one who wanted to sever the non-competes in the first place. You're right, Lewis, I did. But I didn't come down here to play pin the blame on the Harvey. I came down here to figure out what the hell we're gonna do. Then let's get to it. May I help you? Oh, I'm sorry to interrupt, but there was no one at reception, and I have your order here. You gotta be kidding me. You call me down here for an emergency, and then you take the time to order Chinese food? I didn't order anything, asshole. So crouch your tiger, hide your dragon, or I'm gonna wang chung your ass out of here. Louis, calm down. Clearly, there's some mistake. No one at this firm has ordered any food. Well, I'm pretty sure this is the right place because the name on your door is Jessica Pearson, and this order is for Jessica Pearson. Yeah, this is Jessica Pearson. Louis! Louis! What? They know I'm not really here to bring you an egg roll, asshole. I'm here to serve you with this. What is that? It's a class action. We're being sued for every case Mike Ross has ever touched. If you are not, you will face disciplinary action. You will be at meals on time if you want to eat. You will be at work on time no matter what. You will keep your cell in a clean and sanitary condition. If you fail in any of these areas, you will face disciplinary action. Good, you're getting the picture. <laughs>